Hello everybody, uh, let's move right on into the kitchen area. This is the exciting part of, you know, this is actually one of my favorite parts of the whole uh, condominium that we're putting on the market right here. It, this has been completely redone. Now this building was built in 1963, so obviously it had, uh, it had a wall here, a uh, thin wall blocking off very small kitchen, uh, and sort of uh, standard for the time, but, but, but very small and very difficult and very dark. Uh, what we have now is, it just, it's, it's amazing what we have now. We actually have uh, an open kitchen. Uh, let me just show you some of the features of this, this incredibly good renovation. First of all, the granite. So the, the granite is, is amazing. Um, let's see here, I'm trying to use my camera properly. Uh, the granite is, is seamless, so if you're looking here at the granite like this, it's, it's absolutely seamless. Um, go all the way around here. This whole piece here, this breakfast bar where the wall used to be, is one seamless piece of granite. And then it has an overhang that allows you to put stools up along, along it. Um, let's see what else. I wanted to point out the cabinets. These cabinets are great. These were custom cabinets that were put in and are very appropriate for, for DuPont Circle. Uh, solid wood. So these are solid wood with um, brushed nickel finish handles. They go all the way to the ceiling, as you can see. Uh, lots and lots of storage in this small kitchen. Um, again, more storage all the way to the ceiling. This is kind of a nice feature down here. We've got uh, the whole corner opens up and to expose a completely huge, great use of space down there. Uh, another feature I like about this kitchen is the sink itself. Um, a lot of my clients are asking for these and those who have them prefer them to the double sinks, which is, a, it's, it's actually a, uh, it's a underhung, underhung stainless steel deep and one big sink area so that you can, you know, you can, you can do your pots and pans here. And the actual um, faucet can, can be uh, turned such that you have this huge open space to work in. And then you have the nozzle that comes out 